Okay, my name is Chief. Um, my conjecture is that no two world lines can intersect in space time in the light cone. Um, in their past, present, or future, no two world lines of two different particles can actually enter into each other's world line. They can't they couldn't do it in the past, the present, the future. Um so there's two barriers to consider in a light cone. The light barrier that approaches nowhere beyond our present hybrid space. Nowhere um, and space time itself has its own barrier, which is the matter barrier between two each other's two particles' uh, world lines. And then, as you approach the light barrier, matter seems to accumulate mass itself that keeps you from going or into hyperspace. As you approach the matter barrier, another person or object's world line, which is the in, in the present moment, it's third body themselves and its body itself. There's if you try to shave off the surface of the object, another sheet of light appears, just like as another layer of matter appears. Mass appears as you approach the speed of light, the light barrier to get over to the other side where nowhere is. So it makes me think inside the world line for quantum particles, which may be able to occupy the same space time world line as another quantum particle. I wonder if. Uh, The world line of each is um, um, shared if they do cross each other. If they're shared and the world line spread out in space time. And the world line, shared world line equals entanglement. Entanglement. World line entanglement. Um, for particles that can occupy the same space. So, um, um, so my conjecture, my main conjecture or whatever is that uh, no two particles of mass can occupy the same space. But quantum particles that can occupy the same space world line at some points um, spread out the space that they the world line that they share and that world line equals entanglement it's a world line that's entangled in the Minkowski space-time light cone so um and um I also think about going past the light barrier, which adds on mass, which is sort of like the inverse of mass, that if another mass tried to shave off the surface, it adds on another layer of light to hide its true identity as a possibly a visual doorway into another world, um, into hyperspace. And um, at least at, at the quantum level, it's already said that particles are wormhole-like. Well, if two wormholes meet, and they separate, and they're sharing each other's world line, space-time world line. Um, so that's my conjecture, and I believe the ramifications from it.